All right, hello YouTube. First video in a while. I've been kind of busy. My wife had a baby, but um, I'm back and trying to do some more videos as I go about the shop. So what I'm doing today is I'm going to make a backup image of a hard drive that I have, and I'm going to do that using a Cronus. So this is not an advertisement for a Cronus. I'm sure there's several other software options out there that would work. This is just one my friend uses. He's a level three tech and uh, seems to be working pretty good for me. So yeah, so what I've done up to this point, I'm just gonna really shoot my screen here because that's really all we need, is um, I've connected an external hard drive to this desktop and I've inserted the Acronis CD and when you power on your PC, laptop, or desktop, whether it's Dell, HP, Compaq, Lenovo, there are different buttons, but once you power it on, there's going to be either F12, F2, hit the enter button. That's going to bring up a menu where you can boot from another thing other than your hard drive. So I chose to boot off of my CD. If you have any questions on how your system works, feel free to leave them in the comments and I'll help you out. So I've connected my, just to recap, I've connected my external hard drive. I've put in the Acronis disk into the CD drive and booted from that disk using F12, F2, something like that. And now I've gotten to this screen here where I am, if you can see it, going to run the management console right there. All right, so let me, let me go do that. All right, so here's kind of your menu once you get in. I'll just zoom in and show you guys real quick. Um, so the top there is backup and recover. So right now we're going to do a backup. And basically what this means is on this desktop I've loaded Windows, I've loaded all the drivers, and this is a clean image that I'd like to save for another desktop that I have that is exactly the same. Um, you can also use this if you just want to back up your computer, um, if you have a laptop or something like that, don't want to lose your files. It's not necessarily the best way to do it. It works best if you have the exact same type computer. But um, anyways, I can explain that later. So I'm going to go to backup. All right, the first uh, kind of crucial piece here, I'm going to zoom out. So on the right side of the screen, you can see it. It says change. Um, so right now, it's asking me what I want to back up at that very top part. And I only want to back up the drive in the desktop. I don't want to back up my external drive. So I'm going to change that. Okay, the second part that I just did, it's going to ask me where do I want to back this up. So it's going to bring up a little menu just like a kind of a Windows Explorer or my computer in your uh, on your system and it's got options there. D, E, C, D drive. One of those, I think the E drive is going to be my external drive. So I'm going to back this up to that external drive and I'm going to label it right there at the bottom. See that name? So let me do that real quick. All right, so if you could see that or not, I'm not sure, but I this is a Lenovo M81. It's got an i3 processor, 250 gigabyte hard drive, two gigs of RAM. RAM could be upgraded, but that's all right. And uh, so now all I got to do at the bottom right there is hit OK, and it's going to back it up. And uh, it might take a few minutes, so I'll just shut the cut the video short and just kind of show you when you get done. You're going to go to the top part of your screen there when the image is made actions and exit and then you'll go back to that other screen and you'll just reboot 
Any questions, let me know. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye.